Hey guys, quick video today on how to bring back a dead LiPo battery. I bought a truck which came with a battery. The battery was fairly new, but it was so low in terms of voltage, it could not be balance charged. It's a three cell battery with each cell sitting way below three volts. So when you're trying to balance charge it, uh, the charger will just give you an error saying battery too low or voltage too low. So a couple things you would need before you start is obviously a charger and the charger needs to be able to do nickel metal hydrate mode and a lipo tester like you see in the video right now is another tool i would recommend using when you're doing this but first we're going to use the lipo tester to see how low each individual cell in the z battery actually is and then we will hook it up to the charger and we will see the error that the charger shows. So we're going to give it a quick cycle and you can easily see that each individual cell in this battery is just barely over 2 volts. So you cannot balance charge this battery the way it is. Now we try this battery with the charger in LiPo mode. So we're going to hook up the balance connector. And we will ask the charger to start charging the battery, but watch the error that is going to give us. Charger is going to do the battery check and then it's going to tell us that the battery is too low to charge. What I'm going to do now is flip my charger into nickel metal hydrate mode and I'm going to disconnect the balance connector from the charger. So while the charger is in this mode, uh, make sure you set the current output low. I'm going to set mine at half an amp. Now, because in this mode, the charger cannot tell you how each individual cell within your battery is doing, uh, we're going to use the LiPo tester and we're going to connect it to the balance port of the battery. This way we can keep an eye on every individual cell and make sure nothing's funny or weird or dangerous is going on. Because this battery was driven pretty low, we just want to be cautious of that and make sure there is no damage to any of the cells as we try to bring it back to life. What I'm gonna do here is manually keep cycling uh, with this LiPo tester uh, to see cells one through three these cheap uh, lipo testers don't do uh, measurements in real time so you just got to keep cycling over and over again and the numbers will update so that's basically all i'm doing here So now each cell is almost at 3 volts. Once each one of them hits 3 volts, uh, we're going to turn off uh, the nickel metal hydrate mode on the charger. We're going to flip it back to the LiPo mode. We're going to reconnect the balance connector to the charger and uh, that should do it.
you should be able to balance charge this battery properly now and the charger should not give you any low voltage error messages. We're back in the LiPo mode. Let's see if we're going to be able to store and charge this battery. It works. Good news. On this charger, I am able to flip the screen to give me the view of each individual cell. We're going to watch it for a little bit uh, to make sure that all the cells are being balanced and charged properly. Looks like the cells are pretty even. This battery should be good now. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this video useful.